Psalms 27 to 169. One, the Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? Two, when the wicked advance against me to devour me. It is my enemies and my foes who will stumble and fall. Three, though an army besiege me, my heart will not fear. No war break out against me. Even then I will be confident, for one thing I ask from the Lord. This only do I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to gaze on the beauty of the Lord, and to seek Him in His temple. Five, for in the day of trouble He will keep me safe in His dwelling. He will hide me in the shelter of His sacred tent and set me high upon a rock. Six, then my head will be exalted above the enemies who surround me. At His sacred tent I will sacrifice. With shouts of joy I will sing and make melody unto the Lord. The above scriptures are testimonial of the faithfulness, loving kindness, and goodness of God in the lives of His own, hedging them from all anti-progressive elements and walking them through the valley of death unscratched, incapacitating their adversaries. 1 Kings 18, 21, 9, 21, Elijah went before the people and said, How long will you waver between two opinions? If the Lord is God, follow Him. But if Baal is God, follow Him. But the people said nothing. 23, get the bulls for us. Let Baal's prophets choose one for themselves, and let them cut it into pieces and put it on the wood but not set fire to it. I will prepare the other bull and put it on the wood but not set fire to it. Twenty for then you call on the name of your God, and I will call on the name of the Lord. The God who answers by fire, he is God. Then all the people said, what you say is good. A lion does not get to focus because of the barking of a dog, because he knows it amounts of nothing. Likewise, when God is your source and sustainer, your shepherd, defense, healer, restorer, and everything, everything else follows suit, and all contrary views bow or be consumed by fire. 1 Kings 18, 37, 39 and IV, 37 answer me, Lord answer me, so these people will know that you, Lord, are God, and that you are turning their hearts back again. 38 then the fire of the Lord fell and burned up the sacrifice, the wood, the stones, and the soil, and also licked up the water in the trench. 39 when all the people saw this, they fell prostrate and cried, the Lord he is God. The Lord, He is God. Do have a fruitful week. O.D.